YouTube video. I went to Michael's and to Dollar Tree today and um, since, well stuff is opening back up so I was able to go inside the store and like shop. So I got us some stuff from Michael's and uh, I plan on doing some DIY stuff around the house. So let me just go through this. So I am, I had a 40% off coupon and then on top of that, everything else I got 20% off. So I think my largest priced item I got 40% off and then, yeah. And then my, um, um, and then everything else I got 20% off. Okay. So I got some glitter and this is like, um. I don't know. It's like, oh, it's anti-gold. This color is anti-gold. So I got one of these. Um, I have to make sure I don't already have one. Um, I want to make a a tray, um, a DIY tray from Dollar Tree. So I got these like little um, diamonds. They are called decorative fillers from Ashland. So I got these. These were originally $5.99, but they were 40% off. I got them for $3.59. This glitter was originally $3.99. I got it on sale for $3.19. Then I just got some of these little mirrors. These mirrors are $1.99. But I think with the coupon, they were like one, one something. I don't know, child. Something. So I got three of those. Then I got some E6000 glue. This glue was $4.99. With the coupon, it was $3.99. And then I got two of these boards. Well, these are not boards. It's like uh, foam sheets, like inserts. And I'm going to use this for my um, tray. And then on top, I'm going to put the diamonds. I, I guess I'll record that. And then I got these foam boards because I want to make some placemats. I want to see how that goes. So that's what I got from Michaels. I ended up spending about $25, probably not even $25 less than that because everything was on sale. Then I went to Dollar Tree. I got a bunch of stuff from Dollar Tree. So let me go through this like really quick. Because I'm also watching the TV show and I want to get back to it. So real quick. I got some super glue. You know, everything at Dollar Tree is a dollar. So super glue. I got some fix all. I got two of these. Um, I got some of these tea lights. These are LED um, tea lights. And I'm making something else this week. And I want to see how these tea lights look in there. I got some Mod Podge. They are a dollar, of course. Um, I got five things of these glue sticks. These glue sticks or uh, mini glue sticks. 16 in a pack. I got five packs. I got some craft sticks. I got these little um, brushes. It was an eight pack. You know, it's crazy at the Dollar Tree. They have a five pack of these and a six pack, and then they have an eight pack. But why would you get a five pack when you can get an eight pack for the same price? It doesn't make any sense. But anyways, <clears throat> that, I got those things. And then, doo -doo -doo, I got some vases. I got three of these vases. I plan on like decorating these. I think I'm gonna work on these tonight. Um, then I got some picture frames, and these are 8 by 10 picture frames. I got them in silver, and it doesn't really matter because I'm going to spray paint them rose gold. So, um, this is going to be a tray that I'm going to use as the centerpiece for my, um, my countertop, my, um, uh, my island in my kitchen. And then I got, um... Three sheets of this adhesive diamond wrap. So, um, these were the last three sheets. And I think somebody, like, put them behind the rest of them. I don't know, because it was, like, all the other colors in the front. And then, like, the, the silver ones were all the way at the back. So, I got the last three. And then, the last thing I got was... Wait, I got four bases. I got three of these. I think I'm gonna also put those on my um my centerpiece. Either that one is going to go those three 
either these three when I decorate them. I got three of these identical. Either these three are going to go on my tray and go put it on my um, island or I'm going to put them on my dining room table and just move the stuff off my dining room table. And then I got this vase. I might put this one in the center of my um, tray and put it on my island. Just depending on what everything turns out and looks like. And then lastly, I got some fake flowers. I want to like try to put together like a little um flower arrangement i have some more um blue flowers in my room that i have for my best friend's wedding so i'm gonna use those too and then i just got like six or seven bunches of these pink flowers and i'm gonna use these pink flowers to try to make a place setting that i saw on youtube the idea i got from youtube so that is everything that i got today when i went on my little crafting shopping spree thing so i may record some of the diy i'm not sure uh i'm really tired <laughs> it's been a long day so i don't even know if i'm gonna unpack any of this and start messing with it but i'm tired so i just wanted to come in and let y'all know what i got um the dollar tree in my area is nice um so i didn't have to like rummage around for everything everything was in place and it was all kept up nice and stuff so that was nice um they have a lot of stuff for the fourth of july and i'm gonna go back and see if any of that stuff can work for some diys but because there is um there's this game i need to get to use it as a frame and i'll show y'all what i'm talking about later but there is some stuff that i need to go back and get the dollar tree has some really good crafting stuff y'all so if i were you you don't have anything to do this summer start you a diy go Okay, so I ended up going back to Michaels. I got this rose gold glitter at Michaels. It was originally $10.99, but I got it for like 40% off or something. So, yeah, however much that is. Then I got just some more of these. These were like $4 um, with the 20% off coupon. Then I went back to Dollar Tree. I got these two containers because I don't like what this glitter is in. So, I'm going to put this glitter in here. And I bought this rose gold glitter because I tried to make rose gold glitter, but it didn't really look right. So, yeah, I got these bunches of flowers. These are um, carnations, and I just got some pink ones and some white ones. And then I got some tower games because I'm going to use these for something. And I ended up seeing these candle holders. So these little glass um, things they have, that's me. They um, I got five of these. I got five of these. And they had the octagon kind and the circle ones too. So I think I found a Dollar Tree that has everything that I need. And it was really clean. I also got some other stuff from Dollar Tree. But that's what I got for my little crafting thing. Oh, I also picked up these at Michael's are 50% off the two-pack ones. I wish it was the six-pack one, but it's the two-pack ones. This is originally $10.99, so it was half off, so... That's 10, 9, 11. That's what? Um, 650. Plus, I had a 20% off coupon with that. So, I think they ended up being like $4. How much were they? Yeah, they were $4.67. So, that's what I got. Um, oh, yeah. I ended up spray painting those picture frames. And they came out really. They came out all right. I think I need to put a second coat on them, but I think I'm just going to end up gluing them together first and then spray paint them so I don't waste any spray paint because you're not even going to see this top part of the frame. You're only going to see the sides. So one of them broke, but I don't really care. I'm just going to use this one as the middle one <laughs> because I'm not going to the store again. I'm just going to glue it back together and use it as the middle frame so that it doesn't break again or come apart. And that's about it. So I'll come back and show y'all what I make. So I forgot to come back and show y'all my tray. So I ended up finishing it. I did, um, I changed it completely. So what I did was, instead of um, spray painting it, I just like used my Podge and some rose gold glitter I had and I um, put glitter on these. So I'm making another one for my room. So my other one is over here. I, it's not finished cause I don't have any, I don't have enough diamonds to go on the inside of it cause and the diamonds will go in here so on the back it's just um i'm not done with this um i'm gonna 
put uh, something black right here so this is all like one color and then the diamonds go in here this goes on top and then you got your tray so that is going to be the end result i use some diamond wrap to cover up because like where these two picture frames meet right here you can kind of see that i mean if you don't care about it then it doesn't really matter but just to like make it a little jazzy i put these little things right here and i like the fact that these diamonds move around diamonds dancing so then i just put my candle up here i put alexa up here um i put these two candle holders it's saturday morning people outside having fun so i put these two candle holders these are rose gold i got these from walmart inside of them are some little fake um tea light candles is that what they call that i got from dollar tree so they're led no no they battery operated and then i made this vase to go with the tray so i got the vase from the dollar tree i got those flowers from the dollar tree too and i just did the same thing i did with the tray i just put my podge on there and then i just put the glitter on top and then these flowers were a struggle y'all so this is what i ended up doing this little thing also came from dollar tree i just stuck these flowers in here or in this thing my flowers coming out and i just stuck it in here and that's my little flower arrangement So that's my tray. Hope you guys like it. Oh, this is also my favorite candle from uh, Home Goods. It's called Orange Peel and Honey, and it's by Red Leaf Home. Don't go out and buy them because I just love them so much. But that is my tray. So yeah. Thomas, you want to be on vlog? Say hey. <laughs> he doesn't want to be on the camera. Oh my god. I'm trying to build this um, couch thing for my porch. So that's why we're at Home Depot. I got some wood. He back there looking for me a chain. Because I'm also doing a, another DIY project. And I'm going to show y'all when I get back to the house what I'm talking about. So I needed some chains. I needed some of these little screws. I needed some wood. And one more thing that they don't have here. We're going to have to go across the street at Lowe's and get it. But yeah, that's what we're doing. He got all my wood for me. So we gotta load it up in the car. The next stop is Lowe's, I guess. And then we're gonna go to uh, Michael's. Hmm? Okay, so now we're in Michael's. I'm doing these three frame things. I'll show y'all when I get home. So I needed three frames. My prints are 18 by 24. So I got those right there, the 24 by 36. So it's buy one, get two free. So these are $50. So I buy one for $50, get two for free. So I'm getting three frames for the price of $50 when I would normally pay $150 for it. But let me go down here. They got these ones for $20 each, but these are not on sale. But if I buy three of these, that's 60 bucks. And then I have a coupon for 20% off. So 20% off $20 is $4 off. Yeah, <laughs> $4 off. So it'd be four, eight, 12. So 60 minus 12 is like 48. So basically the same price. So I'm gonna get the better frame a better quality frame for the same price as those little cheap ones because what I really need is just the plexiglass on it but I might end up using the whole entire thing so we'll see about that and then he over there I don't know what he doing but he loves this store too because he's an artiste okay y'all I'm back um so he just left because he gotta go do some stuff um, so the frames, I went home, we took all the stuff home, we took the wood to my house house, like, my home where I grew up home, 
so my daddy can like work on it he gonna um all i really need him to do is cut it because i don't have a table saw so my daddy has a table saw so he's gonna cut the wood to the length that i need it to be because i got 10 8 foot 2 by 4s so he's gonna cut those to the length that they're supposed to be and then when i go pick them up i'll just build the the chair or the bench at the house it'll be easier like this so i won't have to carry like a, a made bench up three flights of stairs it's crazy so doing that um i also bought those frames those 24 by 36 frames they were absolutely way too big so i'm gonna take them back and get 20 by 24 to go like i think that'll be what i'm looking for the 20 by 24 will be what i want so i'm gonna take those back and redo them or get some new ones exchange them and then i also went to the container store i didn't show y'all i went to the container store to get some stuff for my closet like one little thing i needed for my closet that i've been needing for like six seven months um so i can finish hanging my stuff up and then i'm going to go to the dollar tree because i need some hangers some little cheap hangers to hang my the part of my closet that's not finished is the part of my closet that's for my boots to hang that's the only part of my closet that's not done so i hang my boots up so i need some hangers for my boots the little cheap ones that you like the little cheap pant hangers i need some of those so i'm gonna go, go get some of those from dollar tree if they have some and i think i'm done like i'm done that's that's like my home decor for this month i'm not gonna do nothing else that's it so yeah um i'll just see y'all back at the house because it's, it's a lot of moving around i'm hot and i'm getting agitated because i'm hot so i'm gonna turn this camera off and i will see y'all back at the house Okay, y'all. I'm back at home. I done sweated at my edges, child. It's, it's hot. It, it is hot. Texas heat is ridiculous. Okay, so. I bought. I got stuff just. I just came in the house and just threw this stuff down on, on the uh, counter. So. Alright, let me. Let me turn this camera around. Okay. Remember when I told y'all that I made this tray and that my sister wanted one, so I'm going to make hers today. I am going to finish making my second one today because this is my second one. This one's going to go in my room. So today at the Dollar Tree, I went and those little gemstones that are in there, I originally got those from Michaels for like $5.99, but I got these three at Dollar Tree. Uh, a dollar so I'm gonna use those instead I'm gonna mix them together so I got those today got these three things from Dollar Tree these little fake they don't always have them when I go in there they're called acrylic gems so this is what they look like I got this from Michaels this is adhesive and that is what is beneath these diamonds so like that right there that sheet right there that's what this is this came from michael's i think it was 99 cents um so that's that i'm gonna fix finish doing mine my other my second one and then do my sister's hers is gonna be purple <clears throat> and then y'all saw me go to home depot and get that wood that i needed to make my um my bench so i ended up having to get some the screws from lowe's because home depot didn't have them so i bought this from lowe's and i also <sighs> You see how this um, bookshelf has like, the it was originally black and I spray painted it white and I ran out of spray paint as you can see like on the sides. I didn't get to finish. So I bought some more spray paint to go over it. And I think the reason that didn't take so well is because it didn't have primer on it. But this um, Rust-Oleum spray paint is satin. It has paint and primer in one. So it should just give like a really good coating on that. So, got that. Got some, um, got some sanitizer, some alcohol sanitizer from Home Depot. It was $5. Um, I also bought, I thought I was going to have to use these. I might still use them, I don't know, to hang up my picture frames. And I was going to use a chain to hang them up. So, we'll see how that goes. Don't know yet. Um, what else did I buy? It's just stuff all around this house, y'all. Oh, okay. So, 
I took my frames back, those 24 by 36, and I got these 18 by 24. So what I originally wanted to do was just use the glass in here and put this behind the glass and then have it hanging up on that wall with the chain. But I think I'm just gonna end up just putting this in the frame like that, all three of them, and just hang them straight up across. <laughs> so, so then the container store, I went there today too. I was just running errands today, y'all, getting stuff done. It's been bothering me. God, I needed three things from the container store. I needed a closet rod. I needed a little thing that goes on the end so they don't stick you. Um, it's rubber, and then I needed one hook. So, going in my closet, <clears throat> this part, all right, let me back up. So, this is my closet. You walk in, and then, bam, you got all, like, everything. So, this part right here is perfectly fine. This is fine. What I need to change, all I need to do is move this top shelf. I need, it's like a few more spots up there. I need to push this all the way up. So this right here is for my long, well not long dresses, but like mid-length dresses. And then my long dresses go over here. I eventually have to change my shoe rack and get the long one so that it doesn't stick out. Because if you can see my shoe rack, this is the wall right here. This is the wall. You see where it stops? See my shoe rack keeps going. So it sticks out. And as you can see, it's taking up some of the space from my um, rack right here. I got those clothes pushed back. So it's going to hold the same amount of shoes. I think this holds like 50, 50 shoes. But it's just going to be longer. So it's going to go up higher instead of being wider. So I think it'll probably stop around like up there. Because <clears throat> it's, I think it's 10 rows or something like that. So, got to get that fixed. And then my closet. So, this piece right here is going to go here. Y'all can't even see it. So, that piece right there, that rack, is going to go straight right here. And then, if you can see, underneath the rack is the hook and then the bar. So, this one already has a hook. So... If this was going to scoot over once I put the other one in. So I just need to put this up here. And this is going to be for my boots. So really, I don't really have to move it if I don't want to. But I'm going to move it anyways. I'm just move it up. And then eventually, there will be no, like that, this right here, this is a coat. All my coats and jackets will be taken out of this closet and put in my laundry room on a clothes rack that I have to get that I should have got today but so these are the little house decor things that I'm doing this week um I really don't know where I want to start I'm actually like extremely hungry and um I'm tired like the heat is so draining so I don't know I'm gonna mess around with this stuff later but right now I just need to get my life together I'm I'm hot I'm hot and I'm tired. So yeah, that's all I wanted to show y'all. Just um, so this is my patio. I don't think I've ever showed y'all my patio. This is my patio. Um, again, I have ten foot ceilings, so my patio, same thing. It's ten feet high out here. Let me open it. So standing over here, this is how big it is. I live on the third floor, so. I have an idea of what I want my patio to look like. I just have to make it come to fruition. So, that's where I do all my spray painting. And then I got a little storage closet out here. So, that's my stuff from school. So, I'm standing in the corner. So, this is my patio. It's not huge, but... The bench that we're gonna make, I think it's eight feet long because the um, things were eight feet long. So it's gonna go right here. I'm gonna get a rug and then a little table. And then I'm gonna decorate this wall. And I'm going to hang some sheer, sheer like little curtain panels up here so people can't see me, even though they really can't. I can see them. I can see them, but like they can't see me. So I'm going to get some sheer curtains 
to hang up here and maybe like some little um, string lights to put across here and then make it my own little. I really want this to be done this weekend because I want to sit out here on my birthday because you know my birthday is on Sunday. But you know, whenever it happens, I'll be fine with it. So yeah, that's what I wanted to show y'all my um stuff that I have to work on, my home decor stuff that I'm working on. Home decor, it's not really home decor, but my apartment is coming together. Like it's taking me a minute. <laughs> I feel like there's still like a lot of stuff to, to get done in here, but I also plan to live here maybe another year, and then after that, I plan on starting to look for a house. So. Um, yeah, I'm about to go feed myself. I'm hungry, so hungry, and I need to go to the store like one more time, but I just really I need to go to the dollar store because they have some stuff that I need, but I can actually wait till tomorrow. I just wanted to get all this stuff done today so I wouldn't have to worry about nothing for the rest of the week because <sighs> I want to go get a pedicure tomorrow. And I want to do my hair tomorrow. I don't want to have to worry about nothing else. But, oh well. Anyways, I'll talk to y'all later. Okay, so if I were to put these in frames, ignore the little black part on there. Oh, I'm trying to stand on the edge of my bed so y'all can see all of them. Lord, I should have did this before I got on camera. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, shoot, I'm about to fall. All right. So if I were to put these in frames, this is what they would look like. Melanin is what makes black girls magical. Real dub queen. I will take the black things off, of course, because it's still in the plastic. But these three things will go right above my bed. That Starburst thing will go over there. And maybe a floating shelf right there. I don't know. Depends on how it looks. But yeah, that's what we got. <sighs> and I finally just said I was going to go to this freaking store, even though I don't want to, and just be done with it for today. So that's what I'm. Okay, I never showed y'all how I make this tray right there. I never showed y'all how I make it. So, I'm going to show y'all from beginning to end. This is all of the stuff that you need. So, you're going to need frames. Ooh, I'm, I'm missing a nail. Ignore it. You're going to need frames. I got 8 by 10 You can use whatever size frame you want. But make sure they are the same frames. I got these from Dollar Tree. They are the 8 by 10 they silver. It doesn't really matter what color it is because I'm going to put something over it. You're also going to need um, this like adhesive paper from um, this foam glitter sheet. It's adhesive and I got it from Michaels. I'm going to list everything in the description box. Um, you're going to need some glue sticks and a glue gun. Um, I like E6000. You can use whatever type of clear... Um, um, gel, I mean, clear glue that you want. If you want to use Gorilla Glue, whatever. Whatever color glitter you want or if you're going to paint it, that's fine too. But my sister wants purple, so I'm going to do purple. Um, you need black paint. This is actually optional. This black paint is optional. Then you're going to need diamond wrap. You can either use this adhesive diamond wrap. I'm going to use this because it's adhesive and it makes the job easier. Or you can just use these diamond wrap, uh, like sheets come on focus all right uh and the last thing you're gonna need is these little crystal um what are they called fillers <laughs> decorative fillers so i know dollar tree sells some and i just put those in this tray so they look a little different this tray is setting like i have a tech an old textbook college textbook on top so it can like set but those are the diamonds that you get from Dollar Tree that's three packages right there inside this 8 by 10 tray <clears throat> but I'm gonna use these for my sisters because I use these these are the same ones that I used in this tray so they look a little bit I think these look better than the ones from Dollar Tree, but whatever. Um, so yeah, I'm about to show y'all how I do it.
that is how you make those shades. I made myself two pink ones, and I made my sister, you saw in the last clip, I made her a purple one. So it's really easy to make those shades, super cost effective, really cheap. Everything I got it from Dollar Tree except for the glitter. Um, and that's about it. So I'm about to end this video. Please do not forget to like this video. Give me a thumbs up. Make sure you share this video. Comment down below and let me know what you guys want to see. Um, in the near future, as school begins to start back, because y'all know I'm a teacher, I will be doing a return to work mini series just to show y'all like how the district and teachers, students, and parents are coping with and dealing with and managing this whole pandemic COVID-19 craziness that we are all experiencing. So that's the end of this video, y'all. I'll talk to y'all later.